damn it, Jim. I'm only a doctor. <laughs> I've actually been trying to get a super brain for a while, but yeah, no work, no worky, no worky. This angle will not work. My buddy uh, Julio gave me a uh, new case for my iPhone. It said I wasn't gonna film again on my iPhone, but the quality of the last video was actually pretty darn good. So I think I'm going to use that because I did not bring my camera. Look at this. What? Yeah, anyway, so, um, yeah, make do with what you got. Let's see if I can do it this way. No, but see, the angle is wrong. I still think that this is jacked up. Let's see how good this kickstand works. What's going on? Seems very stable. So yesterday I showed you my, um, or in the last video, I showed you all the, those are balloons. Here's my other gyroscope thing. What do you call this? You can't really see it though. Trust me. Can you see? You can't. But let me tell you, oh my God, it's amazing. I'm actually looking at many versions of myself. Hey. Oh my God, that's creepy. Lots of hands. Anyway, so um, two videos in two days. Did not think it was possible. Did not think it could be done. But guess what? We're doing it. And I'm doing it because uh, I just got back from lunch. I got nothing better to do. I really, really do have other things that I should be doing. Oh, I wonder if this will work. Not really. At least my guns look big, though. <sighs> Hook smash. Just kidding. Totally. Hulk, do not be pissed at me. Anyway. Now I like... This is stupid. Will it go in my water bottle? No, it will not. So, what the hell? <laughs> Let's see if we can figure this out. Do, 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 do. Sorry. Looking for the kickstand. So, I'm back in my office. It's after lunch. Just went home. I actually had a meeting today. So I had to wear pants two days in a row. Yesterday's meeting, canceled. Wore pants all day. Today's meeting, canceled. Went home, threw off my pants as quickly as I possibly could. Put on shorts. Why do I do this? Well, you know, because I can. I don't actually work for a formal company because the company is mine. In fact, I encourage uh, the people that work for me not to wear pants, which sounds really creepy and uh, maybe a little bit sexually inappropriate. So let me qualify that comment by saying, you must wear pants that cover any of the goodies and you can't leave anything to imagination. You should cover yourself. You're just not required to cover these. Because part of the advantage of being an entrepreneur is that I get to make the rules. I get to do what I want to do, and if I don't want to wear pants, I'm not going to wear pants. But on those days that I have meetings and I have to wear pants, it makes me sad. So sad. But what really makes me sad is when the meetings cancel. Because then I have worn pants for no absolute reason. Which, you know, I live in Austin, Texas. Today it's probably going to be 102 Humidity is probably in the 60 to 80% range. And I affectionately call Austin the pimple on the ass of hell during the summer because that's exactly what it is. I mean, follow me. Hot as balls. Hot, hot, hot. Hot. In fact, let's come back in here where it's nice and cool and air conditioned. So today's video is really about nothing. The totality of nothing. I don't really have a subject I want to talk to you about. I really don't have, you know, any kind of, um, you know, burning agenda. I just thought 
maybe today would be the perfect day to do Ripple Life 8, no, 9, because 8 was yesterday, which was posted today, which means you're seeing this in the future, which is like tomorrow, which by that point will be in the past when you, I don't know, I can't figure it out. Anyway, um, catch you up on this week. Had a great, great meeting today online with a um, large owner that I use for my construction software. And we developed some stuff for them that they hadn't seen yet, but were thrilled. I've decided mine. Those are all gonna be sound effects that I don't have to pay for that I'll just include in my videos. You're welcome. Um, anyway, construction. They uh, love this thing that we did specifically for school districts and they were tickle pink. And then I showed them my other company, which is a product that we are developing for school districts, but it's separate from my construction software product. And they were like, bing! Did you ever see, um, what was that movie? Oh crap, Jim Carrey, The Mask. When he was like, wah, wah, wah. You could see there were reactions abound. People were excited, they loved it. They were thrilled that we potentially listened to some of the issues that districts have and we were able to, through software, be able to solve some problems. And so that meeting went awesome. And yeah, so that was gonna go well, that went well, and then I was gonna go to this lunch, and then the lunch didn't happen. And so I went home, and I ate brisket, talked to my wife for a little bit, and then I uh, ate a whole green chili pepper, because I went and bought green chili peppers on Sunday, because I am New Mexican, and I am exiled in Texas, and when it's Green Chili Festival Day at Central Market, I go down, I pay way too much money for my green chilies, I get them in mass, and then I consume them. That's what I do. So anyway, I have been eating green chilies like you would not believe. Uh, I believe my colon is sufficiently um, uh, cauterized in all the areas that it might have not needed, or might have needed cauterization, I'm not sure. But I'm feeling really good, really healthy. Have not turned green yet. Or have I? Anyway, we had a green chili pepper, which was hotter than balls. Wait, I already said that. It's hotter as balls out there. It was hot as balls in my, my throat and my, my belly because the chili pepper was that hot. So I'm thrilled that we got legitimately a case of hot green chilies. <clears throat> so well done, Central Market, for wherever you bought them. And then I came back here and really did not feel like getting into anything just yet. I have to write a blog post for my software company today and kind of pretend to do some work. But that's, that's it. That's it. Nothing else going on. One of my employees is at lunch. My other employee is at her home office. My other other employee is at her home office, which is technically my wife. I can't call her my employee. My chief strategist, my CFO, my person that doles out all the money the person that is the only other person at this company that has the ability and the power to fire me. Um, yeah, all those things. And so I'm sure she would not be thrilled if she knew I was making videos during the day, but I really don't care. She doesn't watch my YouTube channel. She watches both of my kids' YouTube channels and she's like, oh, you did another video? Oh, and that's nice. That's awesome. What'd you do, talk Ripple? Talk connecting? Do you talk? Nonsense. Did you show your audience how crazy and stupid you are most of the time? And I went, no, I do not do that. Uh, I am very, uh, very uh, professional on my video. Why do I switch to, like I'm working like at a, I don't know where you'd work with that accent. And that would be unfortunate that I even went there. So I, I don't know why I went to that accent and certainly not, um, I'm just gonna cut this anyway she would probably not be thrilled that I am videoing when I'm supposed to be working 
finding more school districts to go sell my construction software to you or my other product or finding some other area to hire me as a speaker, which by the way, I did get hired yesterday for a speaking gig, actually two speaking gigs. Um, and they were pretty darn close to paying me my daily rate, which was awesome. Um, I really need an agent. I'm just too nice. You're like, ah, oh, you know, that's just too high. We don't have much budget. Can you help us? I'm like, oh yeah, what do you need? I mean, just speak for free. I mean, I'll do that because I'm stupid. Um, anyway, yeah, I didn't really do that. And I'm really, I think I'm not stupid, but sometimes I'm too nice. You're too nice, man. You're too nice. Again, the accents, what's up with that? Anyway, I guess I need to get at it. And so, Ripple Life.